Hey guys, today I'm doing another one of my end of the week vlog things that goes up on a Sunday and I talk about my week of stuff. And one of the big things that happened this week to me was I went back to college or A-levels or whatever you want to call it. Um, which kind of sucked, but I dropped further maths, which is good, because further maths is not great, unless you're really good at maths. So don't, don't take that as a thing if you're taking A-levels. Do it, it'll be useful. I also did a bunch of computing project, which is just lots of programming and stuff which is fine, because I can program. And um, on my Friday, I had no lessons, because I have five frees. So that was good. I did not much. Um, in terms of games, I actually finished Portal. Um, really old game, takes like two hours to complete. It took me about 18 months to actually do it. Um, so that's good. Um, Amazing ending though, it really blew me out of the water, because I hadn't even seen it, it was just pretty, uh, pretty great, uh, pretty great experience. I also played some, um, Heroes and Generals, which is a free-to-play game on Steam, it's a first-person shooter, World War II style, um, very different to Call of Duty, well, semi-different to Call of Duty, I'd more liken it to, uh, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Phantoms, in that, uh, it's very tactical, and you want to move tactically and shoot things. I have a video coming up on it, so it'll be explained more there. But the bit, the best thing about it is you can ride like bikes, like civilian bikes, and you look so dumb. The um, so that's that's good. Uh, and Sims Four got released. I haven't played it yet, um, but uh, I watched various live streams, and it looked pretty good, uh, better than I thought it would be. Uh, but I have been playing a crap ton of Sims Two because that is my favorite Sims. Uh, today, me and my friend did this thing where we bought a one-person apartment and filled it with people and did a slumlord thing. And I'm thinking of turning that into a series. Um, I wouldn't play Sims 3 because it's like um, the Sims 4, bro. But because Sims 2 is old, I think it would be worthy of some kind of Let's Play. And I have Ultimate Edition, so there's like renting apartments and pets and shit. So that's fun. Um, so I'm thinking of doing that. Maybe if you think I should do a Sims 2 series, that'd be great. Or maybe get Sims 4, but I'm not too hyped for that, so... And in my opinion, Sims 2 is the best. Um, that's all my games. Uh, in terms of news, um, I'm trying to speed through this a little bit, because I have a lot to talk about, and my uh, vlogs have been a bit long. So, you know. Anyway, in terms of news, PewDiePie stops his comments because... Well, people... I don't know. He stopped him probably because a lot of people don't like PewDiePie for some reason. Um, I'm not a fan of him, but I don't hate him, and some of his stuff's kind of funny in small doses. Um, but he basically turned off his comments because he's saying he can't really see his fans or bros um, because there's so many people telling him to kill himself and stuff because apparently being incredibly famous, well, maybe not incredibly famous, but incredibly successful makes people hate you. And yeah, he's a millionaire because he has 30 million subscribers, gets an average of 4 million views per video, which he does every day. And I think a lot of like gamers are like, oh my god, he's not taking it serious enough. It's video games. Don't take video games seriously. Sure, if you're, like, Major League Gaming or, you know, take them a bit seriously, but don't start hating people because of the way they play video games. That's just pretty fundamentally fucked up. Um, don't get too angry. Uh, but yeah, he turned off his comments to stop people telling him awful things. And it's okay. If I had a channel that big, I probably wouldn't have comments. But I like having comments because all of you guys are really nice and don't say horrible things and, you know. So, yay. Um... <laughs> I am selling my PS3, that's in the news. No, I'm selling it because, I, uh, the reason that I mention that is because GTA V is not delayed yet for PC. Um, so I sold my PS3, it was Sam in the process of selling my PS3, because I don't need it anymore because GTA V is coming to the PC, and that is the only reason I had a PlayStation. So that's good. Um, ooh, next thing, Steam actually took down a broken game, which is weird, because that's kind of all Steam is. Um, they took down Stomping Land, which was so broken that uh, just... People bought it, and they didn't get refunds, because Steam, um, but they took it down because it was so broken, and the uh, trailers and adverts were bad. Uh, well, no, no, they were good, but the game was bad. And in fairness, if you look at a game, don't think, oh, well, I've looked at it for three seconds, it's probably good. If it's free, sure, whatever, but if you're going to pay money for it, just go on Twitch and watch a stream, or go on YouTube and watch a video for five minutes, and it'll help you make your decision. Um... But yeah, let's not talk about that too much. And lots of hateful gamer stuff this week. Just people saying we're all racists and hate women. I love women. Um, and I love people of every, you know, race and gender and sexuality. It's not, I, I don't see that 
all gamers hate everyone. I mean, yeah, there's a mon minority of people who probably hate people because they, well, you know, don't interact that much because they're playing games so much, but, you know, most gamers aren't really hateful, and the press seems to be selling, well, us as bad, hateful racists who um, aren't great people. Uh, so that sucks, and if you want to hear more about that, it's probably best to go and see Boogie to 988 because he's very passionate about this. I don't care what people think about me, um, but it's, as a collective, it's like, they're... The thing is, the media seem to be saying, kind of dis, uh, discriminating against gamers for discriminating. So, fucking... And from the media, it's like I'm gonna be like, oh, the media hates me. Man, do I care about their opinion. Anyway, um, and round up, I'm gonna talk about stuff on my channel, because then I don't have to do updates all the time. Being SpaceX, super cancelled, I've explained this in a lot of things. Super broken, all the mods are screwed. So I'm not going to just keep dragging my face through a mess of broken mods and bad analogies. But real solar system stuff, super happening, as you will have seen yesterday, unless you didn't watch it. Then what the hell, bro? Um, <coughs> uh, coughing. Um, Red Faction Gorilla is not doing great. Um, which is fair enough. I've done a few episodes. Not that many people watch my channel for stuff other than KSP, and it's done all right. I got like six episodes out of it. Might do another one, might not. And um, but I'll be playing other games because other games are fun, and maybe Sims 2 Slumlord style because that's a lot of fun. Just a small house slash apartment with like as many people as possible. Probably a baby, a cat, dog. Fucking mongoose, a wizard, you know, just go crazy. I think that'd be fun, and just uh, shambles. But yeah, um, so I hope you've enjoyed this. I hope you're enjoying these vlogs because it's kind of fun to do, and I like writing my little uh, notes about my week. It makes me think about my week. So yeah, this has been um, end of the week vlogging. I guess I'll see you next time. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,